Hello, everybody. Bilbo Swaggins here, and we're hopping straight into Lilith. We're on save file through as normal, and we're going to try and get as many marks as possible done for her. We've tried Lilith before, and I believe we had had a good run that ended in an unfortunate case of skill issue, if I recall correctly. But here we're we're here to get our revenge, you know. We're going to uh, win this run, flying colors. I don't know what we're going to get, but I can feel like our first item here, it's going to be a solid quality three item and we're going to go, okay, that's solid. And we're going to be happy about it. I don't like fighting MV with base tiers, but you know, it is what it is. MV, I'm going to have to ask you to die. I wish I had the box. I didn't use the last room, but I figured I was going to need it for the last room. Just to speed things up a little bit, but now we're in this situation. Oh dear, I've done the thing that you're not supposed to do. Do not break uh, multiple heads at once. It leads to these situations where you might get a little overwhelmed with the amount of things bouncing in the room. Although normal envy, not too bad. Super envy can be a little bit annoying because he has an extra head. It bounces into, you know, more heads. Oop, the whoop is kind of good, though. Is it better than the box? Not right now. It could be good enough if you could get it on one charge and recharge it perpetually. But, uh, we're not in that situation. Okay, we have the shop here, which has broken stopwatch. Which is nice. And then we have Roid Rage, which is not really great. The range up, at least. I mean, that helps us in some capacity. I, okay. I was just kind of pinned in the corner. I couldn't really hit the, the bombs away properly because I'm firing from my little minion. Super Seeker Room. Yep. Um, that's useless to me. Uh, secret room. It's probably right here. Get a nickel out of it. That's nice. Although, we can't really buy anything. I guess we'll just go kill the boss. It's kind of a very lame first four so far. I'm not a, the biggest fan. I wanted a quality three item that may, would make me go, oh, this is solid. Yeah, let's go. But no, this is uh, this is not solid. But you know what they do? They uh, they give you the shitty starts so you get the really busted starts toward the end where you don't even have to try. It's just like, yep, we won. I I I couldn't even actually kill myself. That's how strong we are right now. We get a nice tears up and a soul heart. I don't like this room. I never do. These guys run at you and you have bomb spiders running at you. It's 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 not a good situation to be in. But we uh are experienced Isaac player. We we know how to handle these guys. No. I was like, we're at one heart, but no, that was change in repentance. What are you talking about, Bill? Okay. I would like more bombs. That way I can check all the secret rooms. We might get the you know, the legendary R key again. We don't have Forget Me Not unlocked yet, right? What do you need to unlock that? But that's basically like uh, an R key, but just for the four. So you would restart the four. But that is good in its own way because it's the same four, if I recall, right? It's been a while since I got one. But it's the same four, so you can uh, get the same items. Is that correct? Oh, I thought he was going to hit me. But I think so. Sir, I'm going to have to ask you to die. I know it seems rude, but... 
Unfortunately, that is the case. Wow, these spiders are just rushing me. They must know that I am firing from a disjointed, like, hitbox. And know this, that it's, like, not as easy to hit them right now. Um, is it worth checking the shop? Sure, why not? Oh, it was totally worth checking the shop. That was an easy pick. I'm not even going to think about it. It's a shame we already checked the item room. But that's fine. We'll we'll get the benefits out of it on the next floor. Why are you spawning so many spiders, man? It's just like, you knew you were going to die. So it's just like, yeah, I'm going to make it a little bit more annoying. Ooh, the pact. That's definitely worth taking. The pact is always a solid item to take. If you don't take the pact, I'm going to be honest, it's probably just an L tier move. The pact is a solid tears up and damage up, and there's no reason to ignore it. I mean, look at our fire rate right now. Now, our health is looking a little sketchy, but we should be fine in theory. I actually hate these, like, uh... These little uh, guys that come out of the ground and fire the like, old, like I I don't know the machine gun level of like tears at you, because sometimes they kind of like are a little inaccurate and they'll get a hit on you anyways because of the weird Isaac physics with like over the head tears. Yeah, I've been hit I've been hit by them plenty of times. It's quite annoying when that happens. I'm gonna bomb. Do I go for the coin? I mean, the coin's not that hard. You listen, you just gotta be careful, see? It's not that hard. Uh, it's just like, I'm scared because I'm already low HP. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? I got stuck on the mushroom and I couldn't actually dodge properly. Well, we need to get HP. HP is critical right now. Oh no, what a room. We gotta kill some of them right now. Oh, come on. Kill one. Okay, there's one at least. <laughs> yeah, but these guys can definitely get a hit on you if you're not paying attention. Hey, I feel like it's just so confusing to understand, like, uh, their tier pattern. Even though it's, like, super simple. When you got multiple of them, multiple of them in one room like that, it's just, like, you lose track of it. And you'll even might, you might even run straight into one of their tiers. I hate this room, but it's not so bad with our speed. You can actually get enough, like, <laughs> you might not have enough speed in this room if you uh, have lower than base Isaac speed. And yeah, you will get hit. That was also a really garbage, like, double choice. Man, there's just nothing. Ah, bro, calm down. I, I don't need the damage. I really don't. I know you think I want the damage, but I don't. So I think the secret room's right here, by the way. It's not? Okay. So it's probably next to the curse room, which might be worth checking just for the uh, free curse room. It's not. Okay. <laughs> um. Oh, you know what? It's down here, between the turrets. It's not. We're just not going to talk about it anymore. <laughs> oh no. That was bad. Okay, we got to we got to clear these guys out before we move on. Oh. 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 Stop. I don't want to be hit. You seem to be misunderstanding. <laughs> Okay, he just like walked away from me immediately, making that an easy kill. Can I get a, uh, mm, oh, you know, a, a key? Oh man, it's giving me the rough enemies, isn't it? See how like it's a little inaccurate? Yeah, I've been hit by that plenty of times. Oh! It doesn't help my, uh, I'm playing with Incubus, so like, um, Aiming's a little bit less precise than it normally is. 
Where's the other one? Jeez, man. Okay. The threats are dead. He spawned two? See how I killed that one? They're like right on top of each other. What the hell was that, man? Um, could I get a key? It wasn't here, right? Where's the secret room? What's going on? Is it here? Jeez. Missing though, that doesn't help us. It's funny, but it does not help us at all right now. <laughs> um, We need a freaking key. And I think the arena is the only chance we have of getting a key. Because we need to get into the shop to get health. Or something. We're doing it. It's a bad idea, but we're doing it. Okay. That's actually kind of clutch for us right now. I'm surprised it gave us the leash like that. Because this actually helps out a lot. You can kind of see how much tighter knit it is already. Makes aiming a lot easier. And it keeps the two tiers kind of closer together as well. Man, it must know I don't like these guys. Okay, we got a key. Thank you. How generous of the game to give me one key. Um, there's a reroll here. That's kind of clutch, but, uh, I don't know if that's the play right now. We're going to bomb these for maybe the coin potential. The pot play was not worth it. We have one bomb and I don't think it's worth just throwing away our bombs. And then I say that and I'm definitely going to bomb the bottom of this, uh, room right here. It was on the right. It's definitely on the right. What the hell was that free hit that you just got on me? What did he just do? He like shot tears out of his asshole. You know, this guy typically, I, I don't face him besides in boss rush and I typically just kill him immediately. But like, I don't know what that attack was. So I'm going to be real honest. I fought him like, you know, probably hundreds and hundreds of times at this point, but like, I don't know, but this guy is useless to us right now because we don't have any heart containers because the game is not giving us anything of like actual value. I know like we have an okay build going on right now, but like we need HP. Like we need the bare essentials. <laughs> this is like giving somebody like uh, a Lamborghini and you, you know, they, they don't have a house. They don't got food. They don't have any money in their bank account, but you gave them a Lamborghini. Good job. What are they going to do with that? They're going to run out of gas. They could sell the Lamborghini. I can't sell this build. Sir, I'm going to have to ask for one of you to die at the very least. One of you. Well, one of you did. Okay, good. That's progress right there. Okay. <laughs> that was like way too much of a struggle. If only we kept that bomb. Yep. <laughs> That's where we're at right now. We don't have any keys either. What's with the consumables? Could it be more stingy? Could it be more stingy? It could be. And it could give me nothing else for the rest of the game. It's technically possible. Not really going to happen. That's like in the realms of that's never going to happen because of the statistics. But it, it is theoretically possible. Okay, we got a key at least. That's nice. How nice is the game? Uh... Boom is good in its own regard, but we need HP. Like, we just absolutely need HP. Boom was the risky play. We could have gone and picked up the soul heart, right? But, like, uh, 
with the little Chad here, we actually have like a little bit of regeneratable HP. And I figured that was going to be the better choice in the end than uh, relying on a soul heart. Now watch the game just give me uh, health ups for the rest of the boss fights. It wouldn't even be surprising. It's to be expected. Um, We're going to take this. Okay, that's huge. Judas' shadow is kind of useless. Sorry, my shadow. Uh, yeah, that's, that's just useless. So, we're gonna take the soul heart, and we're gonna go. Put a little bit of money in here. We're making progress on the, uh, donation machine, though. We're, like, halfway there. Oh. Let it blow it up. Okay, Liberty Cap's okay. But, uh, actually, I want the leash. Bad trip. At least we know now. <laughs> This is like a, a very unfortunate run. It's a little bit of a struggle for survival. It's not a bad run. But it's an unlucky one. You would think a bad run would be an unlucky run, but like... No, you can have good runs that are just unlucky. Like, I could get poly tears and like brimstone and then the game does not give me any HP and I'm like running at one health. Like, I'm clearing rooms, but eventually I'm gonna probably get hit. Due to some shenanigans. I almost got hit there. I would have been mad. Getting hit by a turret like that is just lame. Okay. Uh, no bombs, no keys, no nothing. Can't get any of these chests. And we're not even going to make boss rush. Because I freaking have to, like, scrounge for, like, every scrap of resource I can get. I hate it. At least we're doing decent damage. That is true. Oh, yeah. Useless. We already took a double deal item, so there's no angel rooms coming up. I guess technically, like, we could get Eucharist if we get Chaos, but that's probably not going to happen. Probably not going to happen. What? Why are you pinning me in the corner, bro? Come on. Enough of that. Um, We're kind of just missing damage in this run right now. Or a good at tier effect. Either one would be good. Going in the corner is kind of the risky move there, but you know, I know I'm doing enough damage and tier rate that I can hold him back. Oh, you're going to take my freaking charge. That's just rude. At least you only took one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I hate fighting these guys. We're definitely not making boss rush. And it's very sad too. The game just not giving me any like... It's not giving me a good enough build to actually rush through the force. Just tis what it is. Necropolis... I mean, sorry, no. This is the depths. I was going to say Necropolis and its freaking obsession with turrets is actually driving me mad right now. Our dodging skills is going off right now, though. We're popping. We're popping and we're locking. Surprise, this was not the path to the boss room. I figured it was going to be. I was going to have to walk all the way back for the item room. Uh, This is just annoying. Two actives, really? Uh, They're not even worth taking is the worst part. The compass is nice in theory. <laughs> we'll pop the prayer card. But like, what else am I supposed to do there? Hope we get a Perthrow rune. And we go back for uh, maybe a reroll there. 
Uh, that's the bomb, buddy. That's not. This is a sick joke game. The active skills, like, I mean, well, yeah, the active skills, the active items. It's just like they are not being generous to me right now. I don't appreciate it. Um, I would grab the one coin, but is that really worth the risk of my HP? Not really. Get rid of these guys. This runs, uh, I'm gonna be honest, it's a little rough. We have the pact, and that's the only thing. The only thing helping us right now. We're fighting for our HP. We're fighting for, uh, our life. It's not going great. But hey, maybe maybe this is where we turn around. We get something crazy. We're gonna get something nuts. It's going to turn the run around and we're going to turn into a, a god. I've had it happen. You know, I've started from the like worst builds and gone to like something busted. And if we get like a reroll, that's even more likely. That just gets us out of whatever hell we're in. Sir, please die. <laughs> just please die. It's all I ask. Oh my goodness. You see how that tier was like slightly angled and it just came right for me. That was bull. Alright, what's our boss? Okay, easy enough. Easy enough. It's like training for mom's art is basically this boss. Wow, another tier's up. At least it, it it functionally acts as a damage up, which is nice. But now we're capped out, so any other tiers up is just not going to help us at all. We're not making boss rush, and it's very sad. The boss rush is already come and gone. But we're probably going to make hush. I mean, I, I smell the run getting OP at some point here. We have there's options for one more final play here. And I swear if it's going to be two active items again, I'm going to be mad. There, please. I'm not asking for a lot. I'm just asking for a little bit of mercy. This is a really hard room to not get hit in. I mean, I, I tried there, but that's a hard room to not get hit in. Oh, man. Is this some sick joke by the game? We just take that for the conjoined transformation, maybe later down the line. But I'm going to be real honest. This has been some of the shittiest items. And I genuinely mean that. This has been some of the shittiest items I've seen. Like, there is no synergy between any of our items here, really, besides the fact that we can duplicate the headless baby here. Which is not gonna actually do a lot for us, because a lot of enemies are flying, or they're just not gonna come close enough anyways. So it's really just a nothing burger of an item in the end. I don't appreciate you shooting tears at me, I'm going to be real honest. It makes me uncomfortable because I don't expect that out of you. Death card, wow, wow. The game's so generous. It gave me a death card? I didn't even think the game would let me get that OP. Okay, uh, we're not looking good at all. I'm going to be real honest. We have two heart containers. Let's kill mom. Our damage is okay, but our survivability is not okay. I think you can technically hit both of the bomb there. It's just, you know, got to be pixel perfect. Oh, 
Um, okay, it's just an empty shop. Okay. When you walk into the shop and you see compost on sale for 10 cents and one other random item, it you may as well just not go in the shop. At least when you fight greed, there's a chance you get steam sale. You're also probably going to get some money out of it. All I got out of that was disappointment. Uh, two keys. Wow. Let's see what we get in here. Oh, wow. Money. At least I'm going to get an HP up, probably. I say probably. He technically could take all my money. Well, there we go. An HP upgrade. We're at three hearts now. We're looking OP. Three hearts and Isaac? Dude. I didn't even think the game went that high on the HP. There goes our double room chance. It's really sad, too. We were doing pretty good at dodging up until then. I'm not even going to grab this. It's so hard to grab this. That was decent damage, honestly. You're going to stomp eventually? Oh, you motherfucker. Right when I fucking like, put my guard down, I'm just like, okay, I'm going to shoot for a second, then she's probably going to do it. That's what I was thinking in my head at the least. I didn't say it yet. Oh, bad reaction times. Hey, damage. Oh my goodness. Whoa. Whoa, and we're only a two-shot kill for the next four? Damn, we're we're busted. Uh oh. Mom's hand incoming. Watch it be a skeleton hand. I'm gonna keep moving because it could be freaking two more hands. We're good, seemingly. I was scared though, for real. You actually should not get near these guys. They will actually whip at you. You think they're just like useless enemies that will never attack you, but they will actually attack you. It's weird. I don't even know why they do or why they exist, but they do. They exist to be weird. That's my only explanation for it. I'm surprised we have not been hit yet. Those were some pretty good dodging skills, I'm going to be honest. I think as the situation gets more desperate for me, I get hit less. But when I'm OP, I get hit more. And I think it's just because I stopped caring. The tears up does absolutely nothing for me. But like right now, I'm like fighting for survival. So my attention span is like at maximum. So like I'm dodging like I have ultra instinct. But I'm going to be real honest. It's uh, it's very stressful at every turn. Because a lot of these enemies have a good chance to hit me like that. And I don't appreciate it. I appreciate them like putting me like through this training regime. Where they like are getting me OP for late game Isaac. But like uh, I'm playing Lilith right now. And I just want to get some of her marks done. That's actually a crazy room. And I'm a little annoyed that it, I have to run through the spikes to get to this. We're going to look for a Headless Horseman card. Or sorry, a Hangman card. What am I... I'm, I'm, I'm a little tired. I'm sorry, guys. I don't know what the fuck I'm rambling about. <laughs> yeah, no, a Hangman card. <laughs> um, Maybe we check out the Curse Room? Or the Curse Room is going to do a full heart of damage. Is it really worth it? Maybe. Bigger Room? Oh, that was a bad bomb. But yeah, we got it. Reed, why'd it have to be you, man? I would have preferred a normal secret room there. Annihilate them, boys. Money equals power would be nice as well, but like, we're definitely not probably going to get that. <laughs> we get a hangman card, though. We're, we're, we might be cooking. Double our keys just immediately. I, you know, I could have saved it, maximized the key spawns, but like, eh, it's, it's whatever. I'm going to be real honest. Our, our chances of survival are going down by the second. 
Especially when we're taking damage from a pin. Ugh. I wish I had more bombs. Or flight. Magician. Come on, man. Come on, man. You gotta give me a chance. It's not really entirely worth to run through the spikes because it's going to do a full heart of damage per hit and we're probably going to get hit twice. So, yeah. I would rather not want to play with like half a heart. Well, this might work out. Maybe we fight a horseman here and he uh, spawns a freaking uh, thing for us to fly around on. We don't. Oh, I should have seen that it was the double room anyways. It's always this guy when it's the double room. I always get hit by that. What is wrong with me? He's a weirdly static boss, even though, like, he probably shouldn't be a static boss. It just makes him easy. Is the game just, like, messing with me? I'm gonna be real honest. Like, we're not making hush. Uh, I'm trying, guys, with the Lilith run here, but the game's not being so kind back. We're gonna, we're gonna check the rest of these rooms here and hope, hope we get a hangman card. Well, well, I hate rooms like this. I didn't get hit. Okay. Yeah, I, I I think I deserved to be hit there with how like nonchalant I was running into that room. All right, now we just wait for them to come around. Or man, he didn't have an incubus like I did. If he was cooler, maybe. Dangle. What are you doing in here, man? I think I said this to you in the last run. You are not meant to be on this floor. Like, you are. Like, you're supposed to spawn here. The game was designed for you to spawn here. But, like, you're not strong enough for this. There are, like, normal enemies here that are stronger than you. So, um, we're in a little bit of a predicament here of, uh, wanting to get into there and the game not wanting us to get into there. Okay. I think you can kind of tell by that point that I was a little mad that I just got hit by that. <laughs> but don't worry guys, we got, we got the shot speed up and the, oh, I didn't see what card dropped. Ooh, that's a, that's a rough one right there. Brother Bobby gets us closer to the conjoined transformation. Which is quite nice. Rerolling would also be quite nice. Do I run back in there and see what card dropped? Man, it's such a bad idea. The moon card. Well. It could help us at the very least. We're not a one shot. Um... We're going to do something dumb. And we're going to run in here and grab Brother Poppy of all cards. Of all items, I should say. Can I pick up both? Oh my god, it's one of those. Oh, it's so annoying. Because I can't pick up both because of that freaking bomb. We could check the pill spawns here. The super secret room is not really guessable. I have a couple guesses to where it's at, but, uh, it could be in, uh, quite a few spots. So, we have this guy. We're gonna see what it is. Full health build. That is insane. Okay. Pretty fly. And I do think the super secret room's on the right here. Like, 70% sure. Okay. Hold on, boys. And girls. The plays are coming in. The plays are coming in. 
I just talked with the coach. He's got the playbook out. We're doing the long con here. We've abandoned all uh, hush related activities, although it was already too late as is. So we're gonna get these two now. Hopefully they're not dumb. Gears up, doesn't do anything for us. Speed down, we're not taking it. So we got the super secret room. We got all the pills and we can get the item in here, Pisces. It, it is a tears up, so it's not gonna do anything for us, but it does have knockback, which is gonna do some, you know, something for us, which is gonna be, maybe keep the enemy off our ass. I think that's worth taking in the end. So, I think that is all. I'm kind of sad we don't have one more bomb here to bomb the temperance machine. Technically, I could play the temperance machine and gamble it all on the blood bag, but that is a dumb idea and you should not do that in any circumstance. We're just going to pop the secret room card immediately. It's super green because fuck you. That's basically what the game told me. You might you might not have seen it because I mean, it wasn't on your screen, but uh, it just my desktop turned to a blank black image and it just said "fuck you," and then hyphen Edmund. I don't appreciate this room. I do appreciate the arcade right there though. I'm always a fan of arcades and situations like this. It will save the run. Okay, we check in here. We have uh, two lottery machines. Why is Dark Bum here? I don't know, but I that's a good thing for us. Oh, it's because of the one item. That's a good thing for us, though. The man's going to spawn things for us that maybe are going to win the entire run. We're going to give our money to the judgment here. Health. Health. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't amused by that one. The laughter was more of just like... Why? Rather than... Haha, that's so funny. You, you're so funny, Isaac. Say the joke again. Health down pill. Health down. Oh, okay. This is an annoying room. Won't be so annoying once we get like a foothold in here like we did just now. It's kind of annoying from our angle. Have I seen this room before? This is a weird one. It's not hard at all. It's just a wall of these larvae. I forget what they're called. They have a name. They're actually a boss. They're just not a very strong one. <laughs> oh, I see that we can get in. Well, we can't actually. Sorry. I was going to say we can get into the boss arena room, but no, we, we definitely cannot. That's not how that works. Man, I really hate that they nerfed a lot of stuff like that. I understand why they did. Listen, I get it. The boss arena room typically has an item in it, like an actual item. So like... It's pretty strong to go in there, and it's not if you're, you're if you're good enough at the game, fighting two bosses is quite simple. I mean, it's kind of the whole premise of greed mode, anyways. Like you you fight bosses like every floor, two of them back to back. Sometimes it'll spawn double bosses. You know, like it's not it's not a difficult thing. For new players, I'm sure it's a little difficult. Is you just don't do them, but like now the new players are probably wondering half the time why they can't get into this room. He's huge. He's absolutely massive. He's so massive. He's so massive. I, I He's bigger than bosses. Oh my god. He's so massive. He won't die. We're playing Attack on Titan here. He's dead. Oh my god. <laughs> Bro is stronger than Dingle. I made a joke earlier about Dingle being weaker than a lot of enemies on the floor. It's kind of like a joke. He has more HP. Nah, that guy was stronger than Dingle. 
That was terrifying. The larva, yeah, the the bloodsucker larva here. He's he's been the leech, you know. He's like he's kind of winning the run for us. He's getting a lot of our HP back. Yeah, I never really consider him bad, but like he's really doing a lot for us right now. Can I use that in the secret room to get a guaranteed crawl space. I don't know. We could also just look for the super secret room, which is going to be around here somewhere. It's either on that middle room on the left, or it's going to be up here next to the boss. Please die. <laughs> Wait, that one on the left didn't die yet? What the hell? Oh no, dice room. Boys, it might, the whole run might change. I don't know. Listen, if there's a reroll, I have to take it. I know some of you might find that frustrating. Okay, okay. We're good. <laughs> We're just gonna reroll them. Range down. I think it's not the worst. I mean, it could have been a lot worse. Could have been a lot worse. Now, does this count? A was? Ah. So maybe it's any weird thing on the ground. Ah, that's not really helpful. It's a little bit more damage, which is nice, but like that's not doing a lot for us. But hey, we'll be able to tell where the super secret room is. I guess there is that. This is why slowing down, by the way, in Isaac can help out a lot. We slowed down a little bit and we went from a really shitty situation to... It, it's manageable right now. But Hush is out of the picture because we had to slow down. But unfortunately, it's just the circumstances. The, the game was not playing in our favor. That's Isaac sometimes. It's RNG Fest. You... Okay, you gave me a dark card. It's okay then. I was about to say, you're an asshole. But you made up for it by giving me health back. So I'm gonna... I'm trying a new editing style, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Let me know your feedback on it. Uh, I'm completely new to editing, so, like, uh... Let me know if you're... If the edits are too common, or, you know, uh... I'm still, like, kind of including too much. Because I'm, I'm trying to crop out boring bits. Because you guys, you know, you, you see a... You've seen this a million times. Me fight, like... Random mobs. It's not going to be any different when I fight a room full of spiders. I might take a hit occasionally, but you'll see that reflected in, you know, the half a heart I'm missing. And, you know, it just kind of keeps user retention up. Or viewer retention. User viewer, same thing. Because it can be boring. I get it. But, you know, I watch a lot of Isaac videos myself. You know, I watch Northern Lion map. Man, you know, I've seen some Victus, you know, plenty of, you know, oh, we're getting hit. Hold on. Just give me a second. <laughs> we'll kill her. It's just I'm, I, I'm talking too much. But yeah, like, you know, they all do a little, well, Northern Lion doesn't. The Eggman, he just kind of posts his videos as is, but you know, he's good enough to do that anyways. That man can talk about anything. You probably listen to him. Um, we're gonna take the upper pass, and we're gonna get the Polaroid done, and then we're gonna do the negative after that. So, no more Isaac for a while after we kill him here. Implying we kill him here. <laughs> it's quite cocky to say we'll just kill him. Oh dear, this is an annoying room. This is what we like to call an annoying room, but I think we have it under control. Oh, definitely break the fires. Honestly, there's a chance they drop soul hearts, and that's a chance enough for me to care. But yeah, let me know how you enjoy the new editing. I try to do something new every, like, 10 videos. So, like, you know, episode 10, I started trying new things. Episode 20, started trying new things. Now, episode 30, we're going to be trying new things. It helps the channel grow. You know, starting from nothing, you gotta you got to experiment, see what works best. I'm still trying to hit this guy, and I gotta, I gotta kill this guy first. My brain's turning off. We gotta be a bit more careful. Um, we don't have enough bombs to just experiment yet. 
I was like, I think that might be a secret room up there, but we're not going to test it yet. Leech, get in there. Get in there. Get in there. Okay, we just got to kill him. <laughs> it's too much of a risk. I'm trying to get some HP from him. Dark Bum's stealing some of my HP, and I don't appreciate it. But he can't steal the HP that the leech gets for me. I hate this guy. He reminds me of modded enemies. You know what I mean? Like some modded enemies are just insane. And if you ever do want to see me play some modded Mike Isaac, I'm completely up for it. Just let me know. I am a big Isaac fan. I will do pretty much anything Isaac related. You're an asshole. You steal my HP and then you spawn a spider. Dark Bum is not being a nice man right now. Or baby. You. I hate turrets. I hate turrets so much. They make me angry. I want to do the judgment as well. But we'll come back to him here in a second when we have maybe a bit more money. Easy room, easy room. I'm sure there's going to be a pot thrower in here, though. There's not. Okay. Just in a really simple room. Did I just hear him pick up freaking... Oh, yeah, we have a freaking dog tooth. Why was I trying to think that was a boss? I mean, a secret room on that top room up there. We know it's not a secret room. I gotta remember what items I have. Why are you here? You're not unlocked yet. Wait, I saw you in the last run, right? You're not supposed to be here. But you are. Oh, it's down here. It's the secret room, not the super secret room. Not a great secret room, though. Okay, we checked down here. Afraid it was gonna be a boss in here, but nope. Just some haunts. Weirdly. I'm gonna spawn two of these guys, because they're probably gonna hit me, and I don't appreciate that. Having multiple leeches is really good for the HP. I'm just gonna bomb him because uh, I need a little bit of breathing room, and we'll we'll know where the secret room is anyways once we hear the howl. I haven't heard any tinted rock howls. That's kind of lame, dude. There's been like no tinted rocks. There, please die. Thank you. I hate these guys. These hypno tears can go a lot further than you think. They're everywhere. Playing a bullet hell over here. Didn't realize we were actually fighting Hush. Stop it. Asshole. Okay. Okay, this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. The haunts and the laser beams. I probably shouldn't have taken that. We probably should have let Dark Bump take it. He will pay out. I mean, he'll give us some dark cards, which will help out a lot. I don't know why I got a coin back there. Uh, so it's up here. Agalaz. Okay, Hangman. And this, and this, and this. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Unknown pill. Ah, scary. Walk down. Why? Why, game? That's not what I need right now. Um, so we're gonna go back to that judgment, get some HP, and then we're gonna fight the boss, which is Isaac. And then that should be the Polaroid done, I think. I think, I think. Oh, no, 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 no. 
Okay. Oh, I just walked through spikes. That was a little IQ move. That was a, that was a very little IQ move. Oh boy. Things are suddenly not looking promising. Come on, come out. Shouldn't there be like two of you? Yeah. Why is the one not popping up? Unless they spawn on top of each other and I just didn't see him. No! You mass you fucking bastard! God damn it! That would have been one more hit for me. Have I ever told you the definition of insanity? Oh, we let the leech do the killing. Oh, they're dead. Oh, no. Well, we popped some more pots and we let the leech doing the killing. <laughs> we need, we need HP. We need that. We at least need the little half heart here. Okay, please. Leech, 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 leech. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> there, die. No, I shouldn't have been hit by that. Oh, God damn it, man. I'm not paying attention. Fuck. Okay, I'm going to go silent for a sec. We need this. Mm, what the fuck, Isaac? What the fuck, Isaac? Oh, God. It's up to RNG. It's up to the gods. It's up to the gods. It's up to the gods. Oh. Iron Jesus, please. Don't fuck me. Mama Mia, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my gosh. Kill him. Oh, he's dead. No. 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 no! Oh, but it still got it. I saw rune bag. Oh, it counted. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh no that was so fucking close we got the polaroid oh man guys that was that was crazy oh man it shouldn't have been that close delirium was there by the way but we would have 100 percent died in delirium like delirium just doesn't spawn enough items i mean we would have died but yeah we at least got that done. So. We're probably not going to do Lilith again. That was very stressful. We're probably going to work on Eden. Or Lazarus. I want to play Azazel more. But obviously you, you see. I, I don't lose with Azazel. We, we keep him for the more fun runs. That way we have something to do with him later on. But anyways. I think that's all for today guys. And I hope to see you on the next one. Peace.